pharmaceutical company CEO, notorious for jacking up the price of a life-saving drug. He's out on bail after being arrested for fraud, but not out of the spotlight. There he is live streaming his life. He's also speaking out for the first time since his arrest. ABC's Mara Schiavocampo has the story. This morning, 32-year-old ex-pharmaceutical CEO Martin Shkreli giving his first interview since being charged, telling the Wall Street Journal he was arrested because of a social experiment and teasing people over the Internet, adding that his erratic social media posts are a bit of an act, saying, what do you do when you have the attention of millions of people? It seemed to me like it would be fun to experiment with. Over the weekend, holding a nearly five-hour live stream, seemingly in his pajamas, just one day after his arrest. While he didn't address the allegations... Uh, I can't really talk about business or, or anything, allegations or anything like that. I can't answer any questions about that whatsoever. He did do plenty of other stuff, playing the guitar, <laughs> taking phone calls, even surfing online dating profiles. Thursday, Shkreli was taken into custody for alleged securities fraud. Federal prosecutors claiming he essentially ran his two former companies, a hedge fund and a biotech firm, like a Ponzi scheme. Shkreli rose to infamy earlier this year after raising the price of an HIV and cancer drug from $13.50 to $750 per pill, a 5,000 percent increase. Friday, he resigned as CEO of Touring Pharmaceuticals and was released on $5 million bail. For Good Morning America, Mara Esquivel Campo, ABC News, New York.